Thank you for joining me. This will be a quick workout to work abs, balance, and legs. It will be a flow of motion, three different exercises. All you have to do is count to 10 each time, and we'll go through those exercises twice. So let's get started. We're going to start just in plie first. So get the feel of your plie. We're checking in on our wonderful posture, thinking like a ballerina or Barishnikov. So we've got our shoulders over our hips. We've got our plie in action. Chin is lifted slightly. We're looking across the room. Chest stays lifted in this great posture as you do a little plie. Let's get three plies, get the feel of it. And then we're gonna add a leg lift. Now, let's do our plie and then a leg lift and down. And let's stay on this side for 10. There goes two. And it's okay to hold onto a chair while you do these until your balance gets better and you can do these without holding on. I promise you will be able to do it. Let's get five more this side. Beautiful, nice, tall. We are in the wine room at my house. That is the wine cellar in back of me. All right, last one this time, in case you're wondering what that thing is. All right, and then just take a couple steps, loosen it all up, cha-cha-cha, and back into our plie. Other side, count to 10, plie, and lift a leg. And if you can hold that leg out to the side for a split second, that's really gonna activate abs. You can put your hands on your abs and feel them working. And we're so nice and conscious about our posture right now. Let's get, I think we have four more. Last four and plie, three, plie, two, finish up that last one and loosen it all up. Woohoo! And next one, we've got lunge and a leg lift. So let's do the lunge first. Let's get five lunges on one leg. Just get the feel of it. You reach out with your foot and bring yourself back. Five on this side first. So pretty simple, lunge, balance is already being called upon. Put your foot way out there so your knee stays over your foot. Now let's try other leg. Lunge it out, push it back. Feel your body weight shifting. All right, one more and then we add, now other leg, 10 with a leg lift. Watch this, we lunge, leg lift, and then put the foot down. Stay on this leg for 10 times. It's okay if you stagger around a little bit, maybe, that's okay. You'll get the hang of it, this is beautiful. Good coordination. I think we have three more this side. Lift and then put it down. Lunge, lift and put it down. One more. And get rid of the other side. 10 on the other leg now. It's a lunge, lift and put it down. Same leg, lunge, lift and put it down. You got this, there's three. Four, five, heart rate's going up, right? Six, because we're working with these nice large muscle groups. Seven, lunge, set it up, take your time. I think we have two more. Lunge, lift, and put it down. All right, come on, lunge, lift, and loosen it up. Third. Flow of motion exercise is a plank. Um, if you decide to do knees first, that's modified, beginner intermediate, you'll want a towel under your knees. So let's do the knee version of a plank first. We're pulling our hips forward, shoulders are up by the ears, but we're gonna slide them down your back and feel how much stronger you are in the upper back when you do that. All right, one knee, is gonna come up. So shift your legs where you need them and lift that knee 10 times on one side. 
Shift your chest over your hands just a little bit each time. Little motion here, you got it. Five more that side. If you touch the knee to the elbow, that's extra points. Good, get two more, you got this. Two, there goes one more, 10. Other side, cha-cha-cha, wiggly wiggly, feels great. And I'm back in our plank position, other leg. Pull it up, tap it down. Two, three, are you keeping your hips forward? Four, five, six, seven, you got it, come on, eight, stay strong, nine, last one, and we take a little child's pose for a reward. So knees are wide open, just place your belly between the knees, little rocking it out. Ah, drop your head just for a nice stretch. And then let's slowly come up into hero pose onto the knees. And we want to clasp hands in back, lift the chin, chest stretch, look up, neck stretch. These are so important so we don't get our hunched over shoulders or tech neck. Squeeze your buns. Two more breaths here, inhale, exhale. Shrugging the shoulders down, squeeze in between the shoulders and relax it and we go and do those three motion exercises again. Plie, let's get 10 leg lifts one side. Up, lift 10 and plie, you got it. Nine, how's it feel this time? Your balance, your balance might be better already. The brain, it soaks up these exercises like a sponge. The brain wants to have balance. It wants to communicate with these muscles so that we can walk tall until we're 100 years old and beyond. Last one, other side, plie, lift. Can you plie, lift and hold for two, one? Plie, lift and hold for two, one. Looking good. Maybe you're holding on to a chair and that's okay. I lost count. I think we have five more. Five, four, three, two, last one. Oh yeah, cha cha cha. To the lunge and leg lift. Check in on posture, feel good, let yourself be strong. One leg for 10, lunge, push back, lift and put it down. Lunge, get that foot way out there so that you can really lean into it and push off. Lunge, four, lunge, five. Can you hold that leg up for a couple seconds? Two and one, that's the extra challenge. So we're going, this is part yoga. You know, this is a tree pose. All right, we got two more. Tree pose without falling over, last one. And loosen it up, other leg. Lunge, lift and put it down. Lunge, lift and put it down. Three. Four. Nice deliberate moves here. Five, six, seven. Can you get it parallel to the floor yet? Eight, nine. Get that last beautiful lunge. Hold it up there for three, two, and one. Loosen it up. Woo, cardio. Lungs are working, heart is pumping to the floor. Let's finish up with our planks. You're on your knees or you're on your toes for a full plank. Shoulders down, one side lifts the knee to touch the elbow, possibly. 
three, four, just look down at the floor in front of you, five, six, keep your back nice and strong, shoulders down, seven, eight, nine, and ten, cha-cha-cha, get ready, other side, plank, other leg lifts, Tapping it maybe. Ten, nine, eight, seven. Nice deliberate moves once again. Six, five, four, three, two, and child's pose. Nice. And just relax it here for three breaths. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. And we will come up onto the knees in a hero's pose. Towel under your knees if you'd like. Hero's pose. And let's bring arms back, look up. Let's clasp the hands and back as an option. Draw your knuckles down, squeeze between the shoulder blades, looking up. We are avoiding tech neck here, and we are avoiding rounded shoulders here. Two more breaths. And relax it down. Let's stand up. Keep looking down at the floor. Keep looking down at the floor. Hands pressed together, look up. That is to prevent any lightheadedness. We press our hands together, shoulders are relaxed, face is relaxed. And let's bring fingertips to the back of the head. One more great posture, stretching it back, looking up, drawing the elbows back. Feel that wonderful stretch, looking up. Tech neck is not gonna hit us. Our shoulders will be straight till we're 90 years old and beyond. Looking up, one more breath in. <sighs> Exhale. Cha-cha-cha. <sighs> I hope you enjoy this quick workout. Do it two or three times a week so you maintain your dancer body and stay strong and balanced. Love you guys.